I have a bunch of modded million dollar vehicles in GTA 5 and we're going to be destroying them using a bunch of different things on this modded map right here and it's even got a hydraulic press. Alright so we've got a Cybertruck, a couple Ferraris right here, a Lambo and even a Rainbow Bugatti so definitely make sure you guys subscribe and drop a like if you want to see all of these destroyed. But before we start with the supercars I think it might be better if we actually start with some more interesting vehicles so I've got a um, Amazon Prime delivery vehicle huh? looking thing right here and we're gonna see if we can survive these meteors right over here guys Okay, so I lined up perfectly and let's go Franklin literally just got launched out of it And I don't even know where it is. Okay, it landed all the way over here But it looks like it's not even in bad condition like to be honest It looks like Franklin took more damage than the actual vehicle. Okay, so here we have this like spinning blender looking thing over here And it looks like we're already taking a lot of damage from these uh, blue um, I don't even know what you call them, the blue thingies that are hitting us. But I'm surprised this um, delivery vehicle is like not even getting dented. It's just getting like little uh, dirt patches on the sides. All right, Jeff Bezos, I think you did a good job designing this car, but I think it's time we just got to destroy it with this Kanjali tank right here, guys. Um, if this thing survives the Kanjali, I don't even know what can destroy it. Um, let's just try like running it over, I guess. I think it actually might be impossible to tip this thing over on its side and like properly run it over because... I don't know, there might be some crazy Amazon technology that's like inside this vehicle. So I think we're just like literally gonna have to shoot it or something. But there's no way it's gonna survive a tank shot, right? And yeah, all it took was one shot and it's done. Right, the next vehicle we've got is this G-Wagon looking thing right here. And this thing is really fun to drive too. Like all these modded vehicles have like absolutely insane stats when it comes to drifting and like acceleration and all that. Okay, so let's go ahead and try out this ramp right here and let's see how much damage you can do. So here we go guys. Oh, we hit the first one right there, but it looks like all that happened was our headlights are gone. Everything else looks completely fine. So let's go ahead and try that jump one more time. All right, here we go, second jump and... Okay, we literally just cleared the whole thing. And I think the impact of us landing caused most of the damage. So let's go ahead and line up on one of these meteors because these meteors are honestly probably my favorite thing in this whole map. Um, and okay, that was an insane hit right there. And our front hood just got absolutely destroyed. And it looks like we're even smoking too. So let's go ahead and keep, let's keep doing these uh, meteors right here. The only thing with these meteors is that you kind of have to time it a little bit, but other than that, these are super, super fun. Okay, so this looks perfect right here. And that was another big hit right there, guys. I think the trick, if you want to really explode the vehicle, is you got to really aim for the where the engine is and then it's going to catch on fire. Okay, let's see how much damage this dropper can do right here, guys. So we literally just um, dropped ourselves in the middle here. And I'm going to try to go as close to the middle as I can because I don't want to... Okay, I was literally about to say I don't want to fall off the side without hitting anything, but it looks like all that happened was we lost a couple doors. Other than that, we're still fine. Alrighty, so we're back at the meteors and I'm going to see if we can line it up so that the engine was going to be taking the most damage. Okay, so that was a really good hit. Somehow our back tire is on fire, which makes no sense. Um, but I think we're smoking an even darker gray color right here. Okay, it looks like the engine's on fire and I can't even move the G-Wagon anymore, guys. So I'm gonna try and teleport it back, but... Okay, it looks like the whole thing just exploded. Okay, so let's move on to the next vehicle right here. This is the Tesla Cybertruck, guys, and I think we're just gonna do some testing, like what Elon Musk did in that one video. Franz, can you try to break this glass, please? Oh my God. And let's see how uh, similar it is to the real life version. So technically, I, sh I shouldn't be able to destroy these windows because they're supposed to be bulletproof, I think. Um, so yeah, the baseball bat isn't working at all. It's not even leaving a dent on it. All right, here we go with the pistol, guys. And yeah, I don't even see a bullet hole. This thing is going to be insane to destroy, I think. All right, let's go ahead and start it off with the meteors over here, guys. Um, and I don't know where the, I think the engine on this thing is actually in the back or like at least where the big battery is. So maybe we should try to aim it over there. Okay. So massive hit, but okay guys, it looks like that dented the whole entire, um, like ceiling of the vehicle. So it looks like Franklin's head is actually sticking out of it. Okay. Let's keep going with this thing. Okay. Yeah, no, it looks like the cyber truck, like even though the windows aren't breaking, like, this thing is like folding like an aluminum can, guys. Okay, now it's time for the hydraulic press, everyone. So right here, um, it looks like the Cybertruck is actually like possessed. I don't know what's happening with it, but it's just bouncing around with the doors open. Um, but right here is the hydraulic press and I'm actually able to control how fast or how slow it goes. So this is really cool. 
All right, so really quick before we get started, I want you guys to go ahead and subscribe and drop a like and let me know in the comments what your favorite part about this was so far. Okay, three, two, one, and there we go. Went all the way down and the cyber truck got absolutely yeeted out of the press. So let's go ahead and see how much damage it did there. All right, so it definitely looks like the cyber truck is not in good shape, but all things considered, it is still moving and it looks like it works completely fine. All right, here we have the Chernobog versus the cyber truck. And I think the trick here is we're gonna either have to flatten it or just slam it into this uh, tunnel right here so let's go and okay it looks like we're even taking some damage in the Chernobog but let's see how much damage we did with that one hit all right so I teleported it out of the tunnel and what yeah you know, this thing looks terrible right now oh um like I can barely even steer this thing like in a straight direction guys this thing is not good I'm sorry Elon but I think it's time we got to say goodbye to the cyber truck so yeah okay well one shot is all it took to completely destroy it guys go f yourself Go yourself. Finally, we're on our first supercar here. We have the Ferrari. I know this thing looks absolutely insane. Even the interior has a Ferrari logo with that sick uh, speedometer on the dash right there. So let's go ahead and uh, see if these monster trucks can uh, destroy this thing. We'll line it up. And okay, that wasn't too bad. Okay, see the thing with the monster trucks is that these things, like after you get hit by them once, they like change the direction and you can't even like get hit by them properly again. So let's go ahead and try out a different thing. Okay, here we are at the bulldozers and these things should do a lot here. Okay, so we literally just got flipped. Okay, but the Okay, see these things are also broken too, like they're literally fine right now. Um yeah, can someone tell me why the bulldozers are pretty much flying into the stratosphere right now guys? Like this makes no sense. Okay, let's go ahead and try something else out. Alright, so let's go ahead and drive on over to oh um okay what just happened there guys? We literally just ran um I think we were running into some sort of invisible thing right here, but I mean it looks like it's doing a lot of damage on this uh Ferrari, so I'm not too upset about that and it looks like the ferrari is also smoking so i'm just gonna go ahead and teleport on over to the meteors and let's see how much damage these things can do on the ferrari okay so let's line it up okay that's terrible we gotta line it up close to the engine i think so here we go that should be good and come on perfect hit right there guys come on okay it's on fire that's a good sign um but the thing is okay i think every time our engine catches on fire like um i literally can't even drive the car which makes sense but um, it's kind of not the best if we're trying to destroy it. So I'm going to have to teleport it over here again. And um, I don't know, guys. Is the car destroyed or do you think we can destroy this even more? All right, guys. I'm pulling out the gravity gun right here. And this thing is really, really fun. So pretty much um, all you can do is pick up objects like vehicles and um, even NPCs and other objects. And you can pretty much pick them up, position them where you want. And if you wanted to, you can even um, like shoot them into the distance. Okay, so I think the strat here is to line up the Ferrari uh, with the meteors. And let's just see if it's actually possible to explode it or if it's just already. Okay, so we're, there you go. We shot it into the tunnel. And let's try to see. Okay, let's try to pick it up again. Um, oh, I think I just broke the whole map, guys. Yeah, no, that tunnel is, yeah, that tunnel is absolutely messed up now. And the ramps. Okay, let's try to get rid of the ramps right here. And wait, where did the Ferrari, is the Ferrari? Okay, guys, I think I just launched the Ferrari into outer space right there. Okay, let's go ahead and get it back. Okay, so the Ferrari landed right over here next to the beach. Um, so, okay, let's send it back over to the map right there. Okay, here it is. Let's try to shoot it at this airplane and see what happens. Okay, so we kind of missed the airplane a little bit, but... Okay, so now I picked up the airplane and the Ferrari, and I think some random pedestrian, but... Um, let's try to see if we can just get the Ferrari by itself, so let's let go of this. Um, let's try to get... Oh! Okay, and the whole airplane just blew up, so... Is the Ferrari still alive? Like, I don't, I don't know if the Ferrari exploded or not, guys. I mean, it looks the same, but can I still get inside of it? No? Okay. I think the Ferrari's done, guys. Let's move on to the next vehicle. Alrighty, guys, here we have the Lambo, and this thing looks really, really sick right here. It just looks like a better uh, Zentoro with, like, the back hood. Okay, and this thing, okay, we just did it against the monster trucks, and the fender is, like, 
does not exist anymore. The front fender is literally invisible, guys. And the Lambo doesn't even seem to be moving anymore. Like, all I can do is wiggle the, the front wheels, like, left and right. That's about it. Okay, let's try this thing out against the Meteors with the gravity gun. And it's really easy to line it up with the... Oh, okay, we literally just got knocked over. Franklin, you gotta get up, man. You have work to do over here. Honestly, we're just gonna try shooting the car out of here. And yeah, okay, instant explosion, guys. The Ferrari is on fire and it's destroyed. All right, finally, guys, we made it to the Bugatti. And this thing is absolutely sick. It has to be my favorite car out of this whole um, video. Um, it even has the Bugatti logo in the front right there on the steering wheel and even in the back. And this thing, like I said, it looks absolutely insane. It looks really similar to the real life version. Alrighty, here we are at the hydraulic press. And for some reason, every time I put a car in here, um, the, the doors and the hood just uh, spaz out and just fly all over the press. Okay, so there we go. The first hit, that was a, that was a decent first hit. I just gotta keep going, guys. Just keep going really, really fast. Here we go, the Bugatti's on fire guys, so do you think if we waited a little bit it would just explode on its own or do you think we should just keep going with the press and like explode it right away? Um, okay, I think we just gotta keep going with it guys because we, we gotta see a huge explosion here. Okay, so I've literally just been spamming the press on this thing and it actually put the fire out. So hopefully this time we're gonna be able to get it all the way down and okay, the car literally just popped out of the press um so we're inside the body and yeah this thing does not look great after being in the hydraulic press for that long and it doesn't even move anymore okay so it's moving and yeah i literally took two shots with my pistol to explode it all right guys so that's the end of the video if you guys did enjoy make sure to drop a like and subscribe um leave a comment down below which vehicle was your favorite or which part of this map was your favorite and just let me know what you guys want to see in the future like what future content you guys want and i might be doing some gta rp so stay tuned for that i'll see you all in the next video